of Texas children return to school this month. It's important for drivers and parents out there to be careful in and around school zones and school buses. Don tips in today with some important reminders. You know, we talk about this every time we go back to school, but it's worth it to make a mention. Maybe we save, you know, save, save a crash. Maybe we save a kiddo, you know, so it's yeah. important to think about for sure. <laughs> Either one would be great. Yeah, for exactly. Sure. So let's talk about tips kind of when you're walking around, biking to school, maybe kiddos are biking to school, yeah, things so like that. Main something we don't think about, especially for the little ones that are riding mm -hmm. or biking. Um, one big thing we always say is, you know, map that out for them before. Mm -hmm. So before the first day of school, you know, walk it with them, uh, you know, ride with them, and try to pick a route that has crosswalks, has sidewalks, mm -hmm. has that kind of thing. Um, and if there's friends along the way that you know that want to walk, you know, in school, you know, have them join them. You know, so that they're in a group, and you know, the more that there's there, the easier they are to be seen. Of course. Invest in uh, the gear, you mm -hmm. know, whether it's reflective gear, you know, helmets if they're riding bikes. And something that's crazy that we always talk about with drivers, uh, but also kids that are walking, cell phones. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, if we, you know, you've been walking before and someone's just walking right at you with their, you know, head I mean, down and up. I mean, I've done it before. You yeah, know what I'm for saying? Real. I mean, we yeah. all have done I it. I mean, I haven't, but, you know. <laughs> Listen to you. You're but so yeah, tell your kids, don't, you know, get your head up. Don't yeah. just sit there and walk on your phone because you don't know what's coming, either a bike or a car or something else. I think so. a good piece of advice is to make eye contact with drivers, whether yes. your child is on a bike or whether your child is walking. Make that eye contact with the driver before you cross to make sure that both of you are sort of on that same page. I yeah, think that's important. And, and go over the guidelines with mm -hmm. them, which sounds crazy. I mean, it's been a long time since I've had little kids, but... You, know, you teach them, hey, look both ways. Do you, you know, there's sometimes there's drivers that aren't paying attention, so you have to. So it, those simple things that sometimes we take for granted, like you've got to go over that every year with your kids. And then as far as driving, you know, now we're in those school zones. Now we are seeing school buses operating again, right? Yeah. As a driver, we need to be cognizant of yeah, that as well. Yeah, for sure. You know, it is frustrating sometimes when you, you know, you're going, you're in a school zone, it's 20 miles an mm -hmm. hour, and you're like, oi, I've got to get to work, or <laughs> uh -huh. I've got to get whatever. But it is so imperative that you truly slow down and that you limit all distractions. Mm -hmm. Like some of us are trying to eat breakfast. Some of, you know, we always think about the cell phone or whatever. But changing the radio, changing dial. the radio. I mean, anything that's distracting is just limit it. You mm -hmm. know, limit it. Don't tailgate. You've got to be aware of uh, kids. You know, darting out. Mm -hmm. You know, from any alleyways, any uh, walkways, any anything which. The best way to prevent that is just slow down, mm -hmm. you know, and pay attention to the buses. You know, when they're stopped, you know kids are running both sides, and, you know, if they've got the red lights flashing or whatever, just pay attention. The biggest thing is if you're in a school zone, don't do anything but drive and pay attention. I and think that, that's good advice. Yeah, they're not, they're not big. I mean, you can drive 20 for a little bit, be very cognizant, and then do whatever you need to do after that. Don Tips, you are so correct. Yeah. When was the last time you had a little one in school? Oi, that was a long time ago. <laughs> <laughs> like a long, a long time, time ago. I can't even remember. Yeah. That's good. That's very good. All right, Don, thank you so much for more sure. information about Don Tips State Farm. Check them out, dontips.com. Always good to talk with you. Stick around, everybody. After the break, the Tri-State Fair is one month away.